And joining us in studio now is Ray Smith. Ray is the CEO of Tricera Financial Incorporated. Their stock symbol is T-R-Y-F. Ray, good to see you again. Good to be here, Don. Now, we've been kind of in a celebratory mode with your company because you've accomplished so much in the last several weeks. Uh, why don't you bring us up to date? Sure. We help people with their credit and their, their money, but we're a publicly traded company, which means we have to file our quarterly filings and our annual audits. And we've been so delinquent for so long that that's what our main focus has been the last six months to probably a year. And as of June 11th, we were able to get all of our filings caught up, the 2013 audit, the 2014 audit, and then the Q1 for 2015. And then we submitted a certification for OTCQB trading platform, and we were approved through that. So now we're an OTCQB fully reporting current status public company. So it was a nice feat. <laughs> you know, a lot of people that follow the markets may not be aware of just how difficult and arduous this process can be. I mean, this took you 18 months. It did, and then each quarter, we have to break down the financials into an XBRL mapping process so that uh, outside investors can run reports. But that's an extra cost that our company has to put, uh, put up which the big companies have to do anyway, but they're putting that same burden on the little companies too. So it is, it's a big process, it's a big cost, but it's a necessary evil if you want to be public. Well, of course, being a publicly traded company is all about transparency, which is what we're talking about. So now that we have all of that out of the way, and congratulations, I know that was a tremendous feat on your part. I know you put in, I don't even want to know <laughs> how many seven day weeks and 12 hour days, maybe 12 hours was a short day for you. But uh, let's talk about the business at hand. Now, one of the things that I find really fascinating about your company are these auto dealer kiosks that you're getting ready to launch in auto dealerships across the, well, across the country, really. But uh, tell us about that again. Absolutely. So we, we help people qualify for loans, and the best place for us to contact the customer is right when they've been denied. And so what we've done is we've created a live agent auto dealership kiosk that's a kiosk similar to like at the airport with a touch screen, but we put the kiosk at the dealership and then we've added another monitor above the touch screen and a handset. And so when the customer gets turned down for that car loan, they walk over to the kiosk and lift up a handset and it initiates a video call from one of our agents at our office right there to the dealership. And our agent appears on the top screen and then there's a webcam between the two screens so we can see the customer. And now we're having a dialogue like we're having right here face to face. What are your challenges? What's holding you back? Well, here and then I can show you our program through the bottom screen because I can manipulate that as an as a agent of Tricera. So now I can walk you through our program. You get to see who I am, we, who you're dealing with as a company. Feel more confident in working with us because you get to see who you're dealing with, especially when you're dealing with sensitive information like your finances mm -hmm. and your credit. Well, it's really interesting because, you know, early in my business career, I was in the advertising agency business. Car dealers were a big part of what we did. And I remember the most frustrating thing for a car salesperson is get the customer in, they go on a test drive, they get to the point where they agree on a price, they go through all the paperwork, and then the finance manager comes back in and says, gee, I'm really sorry you didn't qualify. And everybody's upset. The dealership's upset. The car salesman's upset. But more importantly, the customer leaves and probably never comes back. In your case, the customer stays in the dealership, goes to your kiosk, and finds a solution. That's right. So we had flyers and business cards we would leave at the dealerships, and then when the customer was turned down, they'd be handed one of those. And when they walk out, they don't know who that person or that company is that they're going to call on the other end of the phone. And so that's why we made it more personable and more immediate, because it's like the McDonald's there. We want everything now. And once it's off of your hot button, then you, you, you're on to something else. And people, when they get denied, they feel like ashamed, like that credit score is their character score, and mm -hmm. it's not. It's just a system built to help automate a approval process, and we want to fix that. Now, you've got a program that basically helps your customers adopt the financial habits of wealthy people. Tell us about that. Yeah, it's called Successful Habits of the Rich. Why is it the rich keep getting richer and the poor get poorer? It's their habits. Our budgeting program we start with, most budgeting programs start with how much do you make and we try to create a budget. Well, ours says let's list all your expenses, everything that you know in a 12-month period. You know you get 12 cell phone bills, 12 power bills. We put that all into the system and then we ask you how frequently do you get paid, monthly, weekly, or biweekly, and then we tell you how much each pay period you need to have to cover your bills. 
now that you can cover your bills because you have a roadmap for the next 12 months and you can see how much money you need, you won't miss a payment because when you miss a payment, your FICO score gets damaged and you basically get locked out of 95% of your wealth. Now, I know we're almost out of time, but I know you want to talk about your new website, Tricera.com, T-R-Y-C-E-R-A.com. Tell us about that. Yep, it's a new customer-friendly website that's designed for our kiosk. It's more user-friendly, and it, I, everyone should go there just check it out. It's a lot of information for the customer and about what Tricera does to help customers. Again, the company is Tricera Financial. Their stock symbol is T-R-Y-F. Check out the newly designed website, Tricera.com. Again, that's T-R-Y-C-E-R-A.com. Ray, congratulations. Thanks so much. Great to be here, Don. Thank you.